notes don't have four, okay? I guess I'm showing you that. Can you do a four note pattern for me? I'll copy you. Okay, and then I 
I'll take the cello from you. And then can I see, um, can I see your finger flicks? Like do five each one in both hands. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Five each one, yeah. And then do second finger, can you do second finger? One, two, three, four, five. Good, third finger, one, two, three, four, five. Fourth finger, one, two, three, four, five. You got another one in there. Can I now see you do finger circles so that you're super duper on the fingertip? Like that on each finger, especially your cello hand. Yes, good, nice. Good, make sure that third finger doesn't buckle. Good, nice, good. Your third finger was fine, but the third finger sometimes wants to. Like this, this is what I mean by buckle. Yeah, we don't want that. We want this, which you got. Really good. Nice. Very good. You can do some spider push-ups. Have we, have we done that? All the fingers no. come together here? Yeah, all your fingers are straight. And underneath. So they're going to come underneath. I don't know. Do it. Put it down. Relax your hand. And then you can get out of here. Put these fingers down. Like that. A little bit tricky. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. That's okay. And then we, we go ahead and put them all on the fingertips, and the thumb comes there. Oh, that. They squish down. Squish. Yeah, just let those come down. Let's try this. Let's try doing it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that. Oh, that. It's bad, Can you try that? Perfect. Yeah, that's it. Look, that one's going down. Yeah, that's it. See how far down you can go. Yeah, nice. I really like seeing like the knuckles here. They kind of, yeah, you see how flat that is? That's it. Can you get that on that one? Yes, that's it. Good. And then take it back up again. And squish down. See if you can get that into that. Nicht die Pitna, nicht die Pitna. Ne, ne, tak. Tiki pushke oti. O prolome ich, tak. Ooh, there you go. Oh, tak, so dobre. Cool, all right, good. And then the other thing I wanted to check in with, so you can do some spider push-ups if you can, all right? But the other thing I really want to see is your bow bunny and on the pencil, your mouse house on the pencil. Can you show me? Oh, you want to see the mouse? Yeah, Anya. See if he's got a really good house to go into. Oh, do you have a friend for him? Yeah. <laughs> And the stick is going, so I have dots here. Dot. The dots are going, that line of dots are there, and then the hair is like right there. And then your thumb is gonna come and be nice and bent there. And we have like our mouse house there, right not there. Gonna not gonna touch the hair. As <laughs> much as, it's okay, it's okay, that, that's okay, just for a little bit. Okay, so you've got your mouse house. Can you see your mouse house? Got nice windows there. Good. Mm -hmm. 
Good, very nice, okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put your mouse house and it's gonna come down here. So, oh, okay, I'm, I'm gonna put these guys, they're gonna be here, then they're gonna watch. They're gonna watch you move the mouse house. There they go, okay. So, let's see that again. Hand out, oh, put your hand out, good. Oops, ah, there we go. Thumb goes there, and nice and back, good. Oh, and thumb, good. Nice. Very good, okay? And then flip it over. <laughs> flip it over, good. And now you can just lift up your thumb a little bit. Oh, keep your hand there. Oh, keep your hand here. Okay, I'm gonna put this here. And now, no, you don't grab it, just keep your hand out. Uh, okay. Yeah, there you go, good, nice. Okay, and then your thumb is gonna go in that little spot. And it's gonna point up into the stick. Points up to the center of the stick. Oh, it's on the tip, and these guys, Actually, this one gets to touch the hair there. Yeah. Okay. It's very important. Yeah. Okay. So you got that right there, just like you had your bow Love bunny your thing. Okay. And we're gonna keep it up, nice and vertical, so pointing up. Good. This doesn't reach under. It's actually just right on top because we want to keep a nice open mouse house door. Not bad. Good. You make it straight, we're just going to keep it straight up and down. Up, straight up and down. Yeah, that's vertical. We're going to keep it vertical because right now your mouse house, the front door is closed. Why? I don't know why. Probably because your first finger is kind of coming down and over like that. We want to keep it kind of up. And then I put it with the arm. Good. Okay? No, just keep it, keep it straight up and down. Only up and down right now. Okay, I'm gonna keep it vertical. Mm. Yeah, and you use your cello hand, hold to help, to help you support. Yeah, so you can support your mouse house. Here. This is a nice mouse house. Very. The hector better mouse house. Let's try this. This is my palsy. You'll get it. You'll get it. Good, there you go. That's better. Yeah. Oh, keep it vertical. And where's your, where's your doorbell? Mm-hmm. Good. Nice. Okay, I'm going to take it away. We're going to find it again. Oh, it's whatever that one. Okay. This is where your thumb goes. Okay, your thumb goes in that spot. See how my, my first finger, you're kind of doing that, and that's closing the front door of your mouse house. So you're trying to keep mouse. that, yeah, the mouse can't go in. That's sad, okay? But if you open it up, so all of the base, this is really important, huh? all the base of my hand, here, we're gonna sit in here. Ah, you're and you're gonna watch here, watch here. The base of my hand isn't touching the stick. Do you see how high my knuckles are? Yeah, and I, you can put that there. Sometimes this happens. Oh, Anna, look, not good, open. Yes. Okay? Can you try that? Find your mouse house again? And use your cello hand. Hold the bow with your cello hand so that you can find it. Yeah, you can let your, your arm can come down. Yeah. Can you put your arm down? Yeah, there you go, good. Arm is down. Thumb is down. That's good. Yeah, okay. We keep it vertical. I want you to keep it vertical right now. So vertical means pointing the tip to the ceiling. Always keep the tip to the ceiling. Nice, good, okay? We're gonna take this away and you're gonna find it again. Okay, you gotta find Really make sure that we get the mouse house, okay? Find it again. Use your cello hand to help you. Let your elbow come down. Yeah. Remember the dot where your thumb goes. So here's the only other thing I want to say. Oh, keep your elbow down. You can move these guys just back down to the frog. 
Oh, but you see your knuckles are touching the stick? Pretty good. Front door is a little bit closed, but that's pretty good. Elbow can stay down though. Good. Not bad. Okay. Let's see if we can find it again. I know. This is like you got a good mouse house there, but we got to make sure that you can get a really nice mouse house here. All right. It's really important. Five times a day. Five. Uh huh. Five times a day. You do this. Now we're take it away. Ruku puste. That's pretty good. good. Okay, I'm gonna give you something else. Can you pick one of these guys? Um, I will pick a Oh, I can't pick one. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, okay. one. That one? Okay, cool. No, 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 that's fine. I keep trying to figure out which way is upside down on this. I think, I don't know. I'm very, this way. They're very disoriented. This way. I think it's upside down. I keep looking at them and thinking that they're like falling down, but I think they're just upside down. Okay. I think for you, your pinky is going to come like right there. But I need your pinky to feel that spot. Okay? Kitty. Find your mouse house again. Fourth finger is going to go on the kitty. Kitty. That's your third finger. Fourth finger goes on the kitty. Yeah. Good. Yes. Getting better. Much better. Good. And you can let your arm come down. Yeah, so you can let this, you can just let that sit there on your knee, okay? That's mouse house number one. Good. Give me mouse house number two. Take it away. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Give yourself mouse house number two. Good. Nice. Very good, okay? And you can like again just let your arm yeah get used to like Sit. you pretend like you're just having to do these pinky arms or something okay just keep your arm closed yeah good very nice okay five times a day you find that okay good and put the bow down and we'll put it next to the next to those guys okay i'll take this back from you because now you're finding your mouse house there instead okay and i want to do one more thing i want to take one more thing you got your mouse house five times a day <gasps> Back over here. Yeah. Scoot forward on your chair. Yes. Okay. And again, can you tap that magic spot on your thumb here? Yes. Remember, curved thumb. Can you put that into the cello donut? Good. And all four fingers down on the A string. Good. Nice. Okay. This is really nice here. Now you're just going to with your really curved fingers. Go ahead and let the A string get the A string to tunnel. What was that? Tunnel hands. Yeah, yeah, you got tunnel hands, but we're going to skip tunnel hands now. We're going to work on something else, but this is the same idea, okay? I do want you to keep practicing tunnel hands. Why? Why? So you practice having that really nice tunnel. You're going to pluck your A string two times or three times. Good, lift your fourth finger. So just third finger is down, all three, these three fingers are down. Lift the fourth finger, lift this one, lift this, lift just this one, lift it up, there you go, lift it, lift, okay, three fingers, yeah. <laughs> you're like, come on, thank you, you lift up. <laughs> Don't get angry with it, it's okay. Good. Bent them. Good. Lift up your fourth finger. Good. There you go. Nice. And then you're just going to use, get those three fingers curved. Remember, we don't want those buckled fingers. We want on the fingertips, right? Actually, let's do a tunnel dance really quickly. Can you do a tunnel dance? So you have to start with them on the D string, right? Okay. So they got to jump over the D string. Your fourth, your fingers have to be on the D string, right? And then you can do your A string hands. Cello class, and then this like happened.
happen to you, okay? Can you put all four fingers down now on the A string? Just like you did for your tunnel dance. Good. And we're going to get that fourth finger pinky on the pink. Pinky for pink. Okay. Pinky for pink. Okay. Good. And on the stickers. Yeah, there you go. Good. And then plucking here. Pluck your A string. Good. And now lift up your fourth finger. I'll keep your third finger down. Lift it up. There it is. Good. That's it. That's all you need. Now play your third finger. That's it. Good. Lift second and third finger. And move your first finger back to the spot. Good. You're going to have to put a little bit of weight in there. Try it again. Good. That's it. Good. And then open A, so lift off your first finger. Lift off all fingers, no fingers on the A string. Lift them off. Lift them. There you go, good. And then open A three times. Good, now get them all on the D string. And get your fourth pinky to the pink. Just all the pink, the fourth pink. Fingers. Pinky to the pink. Pinky to the pink. Okay. And check your thumb, nice, it's nice and bent. Using the weight to get your the string down to the finger board. Good, go. Good, lift the pinky. Good, good. Good, and now move your first finger back. Good. Oh, and lift, lift second and third finger. I'm gonna give you some extra weight. Good, and then open D. So when I say D down scale, this is what we're talking about, okay? I want to do it again, make sure that we got it, okay? All four fingers on the A string? Mm, not again. Yep, we're going to have to do this. So this is going to be like a three times a day thing, okay? Making sure you're on the fingertips, bent thumb. And it's okay, this is really important, it's okay that the first finger is not on the blue right now, but after you play these guys, when you lift off the third and second finger, you need to move that back. Okay, so yeah. this is fine. I'm going to move it. <laughs> yeah, you can move it back. You don't have to have it there now. It's just when it's time to play the first finger, you move it back. Okay, good. Good. Third finger? Fourth finger. That's third finger. You lifted off fourth finger, and now you're playing third finger. Yeah. Good. Lift off second and third, move first finger back. Good. Can you do that again? Just have a bent thumb. Nice. Good. Open A. <laughs> Good morning, coffee. <laughs> okay, all four fingers on the D string. You're almost done. Just need to make sure you understand this. All four fingers on the D string. Pinky to the pink. Yeah, they are. They're kind of sinking in. They're like <laughs> into the string. Good. Lift the pinky off. Third finger. Good. Lift the second and third finger. Move first finger back. Good. And open D. <laughs> down scale. I know it's a lot, but it's going to get your hands stronger and then you'll be able to make a really nice sound. Okay? Bent thumb. This is looking really nice. Okay? That's really good. Okay. I'm going to put a thumb. Very nice. All right. Let's take our bow and then we'll write stuff into your book. Okay? Ready? And you're sleepy. <laughs> you say thank you for teaching me. Thank you. You're very welcome. Okay, let's while you're putting away your chill, let's go through the stuff you gotta practice. Okay? Alright. Got your practice book? 